So soft, so creamy, yummy, creamy, ube halaya. Hello, 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 guys. Want to know how to do this yummy dessert? Stay tuned and we will teach you how to do this and make it business as well. First, scrub the ube tubers to remove excess oil and dirt to make sure it's clean when you prepare it. Then, bring to boil until fork tender so it's easy to mash or grate it. You can also use blender or food processor to mash it. Check it once in a while if it's tender. When it's tender or soft, drain and let it go before peeling it. Now let us peel and remove the skin. Guys, make sure you remove the hard or rough part so you will achieve smooth texture. The complete list of ingredients and coasting is posted at the description box below so you will know how much profit you will earn from selling this. This is not usual ube halaya. It's creamy and very yummy. You can sell this at a very reasonable price and make a big profit. At this moment, you can mash it or grate or use a blender so you can achieve smooth texture. Make sure there is no lump. Mommy will try to use a blender. That is why she is cutting it to small pieces. But since her blender is small, mommy was not successful, so she did the traditional way. She grated it. Ta-da! The texture is very smooth. We also need the following ingredients. Cream, condensed milk, ube condensed milk, and margarine. Or you can use butter too. One half cup of sugar, two guys. First, spread some butter or margarine to the pan. If you are using a traditional pan or kawa, put generous margarine so the ube will not stick to the pan. Butter is a very important ingredient in this recipe. It blends the taste of the cream. Now let us put the mashed ube in the pan. Then add the ube flavored condensed milk. This will boost the color of the ube. You can use whole can of ube condensed milk instead. Or you can use no flavored condensed milk if no available ube flavored condensed milk. Just mix until well blended. This is one of mommy's specialties. She wants to share this recipe so you have another negocio idea. Now let us add the non-flavored condensed milk. And mix well again. Ube is purple sweet potato in English. It is commonly used as midday snack or dessert. And now let us add the cream. It will make our ube halaya very creamy. Ube halaya is also used in breads, cakes, and other desserts such as halo halo and ice cream. As a matter of fact, ube flavored breads or kakanin are trending right now. Before cooking it to low fire, taste it if the sweetness is enough for you. Add the sugar to adjust the sweetness. Then mix again. By the way, guys, please support us by subscribing and sharing our videos. Now our mixture is ready to be cooked on low fire. The process is very simple, but it does need a little patience and lots of elbow grease as it requires continuous mixing or stirring to prevent burning and sticking at the bottom. 
add margarine or butter once in a while to avoid sticking to the pan. It may take 20 to 30 minutes to fold and cook until thick enough to mold into shape. Prepare our container by greasing them with butter or margarine. Our mixture is starting to thicken in a few minutes. It is done. Turn off the fire and it's done! Let us transfer it to our containers. Hindi puluki ang bibili kasi purong pudo po ang ube halayan natin at walang halong extender. Transfer and let them cool before putting them in the wrap. For me, ube halaya is best served when cold. You may serve this on any special occasions like birthdays, anniversary, fiesta, and the like. Let us top it with latik or shredded cheese or sweeted makapuno. But I prefer shredded cheese with my ube. Our 1 kilo ube haliya yielded 4 containers. Ube haliya may last up to 3 days in the fridge or up to 1 month in the freezer. You may sell them for 130 to 150 pesos per tub. Again, di pulugi ang bibili kasi purong puro at walang extender. Mas makapal pa ang serving kesa sa mga nabibili sa market. Check the complete costing in the description box. Finally, these are the final products. Best part, taste this time! Very soft and creamy. No extender. Yummy! Guys, this is so creamy and delicious. If you want to order, just message us or comment below. Char! Two thumbs up for this recipe! Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.